Hi, and welcome to Crypto Crazy. I'm Cal, and today I'm going to talk to you about Salt Swap Finance. Now, this project is relatively new, and if you see on the screen, you'll see that it's up nearly 900% in the last 24 hours. Now, you may see that and think, well, that's gone up a great deal. It probably isn't the time to buy. Now, sometimes the price does dip back down again, especially when people who have bought recently have seen large gains. But I just want to talk to you about this project, what it does, and why it still may have potential to grow a considerable amount. So if we just have a look at the fully diluted market cap, it's just over a million dollars. And considering that it's gone up a, a, a significant amount in the last 24 hours, you can pretty much see what that started off at. The volume has been quite large over the last 24 hours. So it's not something that's pumped with very small volume. There is clearly a lot of volume at the moment. But let's just have a look at what's going on in this project and why it has potential to grow. But just before we do that, let's have a look at the chart. So as you can see, earlier on in March, it was at quite a high a price. It was at $10, so five times the amount that it is at the moment. And then it gradually came down. And I think with a lot of these types of projects, they have the potential to do well, but unless they're actually showing they can do something, people are going to sell up. So it stayed at a very low price and now it's beginning to turn up. And I'll go into details as to why. But just before that, you can get this on pancake swap. So you can get it with salt. That's the ticker. So if we just go over to the page, now this probably doesn't look that dissimilar. You've probably seen things like pancake swap, bakery swap that I covered the other day as well. And now you're probably thinking, well, salt swap. And you can probably recognize this image here as well, this gentleman with the glasses and putting down the salt in that manner. So yes, they do have a similar sort of features, these platforms, which is why they have the potential to grow as well. Now, some of those other ones have a significant amount locked up in terms of their farms and staking pools and so on. And as you can see here, this has close to four and a half million. So a small amount, but not that small. And I think this could continue to grow. So if we just have a look at that, we see that they have the usual things that you would see, liquidity, farms, pools. They have this thing called Ocean, a lottery, but they also have IDOs as well. Now, as we know, launch pads, NFTs are the two big things that are in this year. Now, they don't have NFTs, but they have IDOs. And when I was talking about Bakery Shop the other day, they had both of them, IDOs and launch pads. But I'll go into details about this, what type of projects they have, and how much more they could be potentially be doing. But if we just have a look, like I was mentioning, so you have the usual things that you would expect. You have an exchange. Again, this doesn't look too dissimilar to PancakeSwap, for example. You have your liquidity as well that you can add. You can farm to. So here you can have a look and see what the returns are. And these returns are incredibly high. So if you do think that salt will go up in value, paired with a stable coin here, really, you're getting over 900% annual return on there. So if there's something that you do believe in, I think it has a significant amount to return to you. And you do have others as well, not just with salt, but with other coins too that you would usually expect to see. So if we just have a look at the the pools as well, you can have a look and see what pools you can again put to and you what sort of return you get on salt you get a 10x on the other kind coins it's smaller but again if you believe in salt coin it's a it's going to be a good return and they have something called oceans too and as it mentions here you have you can stake your salt to earn new coins and you can unstake them at any time so here's what they have the different coins you have as well your cake here and you can just put it into it and get these returns. So again, another way, way to increase. Now, some of these platforms usually don't have a lot of 
these type of coins, these rewards to start off with, but then they begin to add. And I think that's what adds value. So what I just want to say to you is there are some people out there who want to get coins early where they have potential to grow. Sometimes coins have already brought into the pipeline what they have and they've grown a little bit and they're already working on what they could do grow as well. So with, with a coin like this, a 1 million market cap, it does have a long way that it could potentially grow as well. So it has that potential. And, and if you believe it to be true, if they can carry on adding, get more liquidity as well, add more coins, again, like I, I mentioned the IDOs as well, then obviously it can grow a significant amount. So like I mentioned, they have lottery as well. It's not a, a, a great deal at the moment, but it has that that function and it will add to it and you can have a look at the part past draws as well again and not a significant amount as you saw at the start the pool size was bigger because obviously the value of the coin was bigger and it's been particularly small but it has the potential to grow and here's what i mentioned the launch pads for ideas now launch pads really do help these these new projects come about and grow in incubators but then also allow them to release their coins as well so they've worked with a, a few here this is the current one at the moment yuzu swap and what you'll see is a couple of them a few of them are similar to what they are doing they are swaps but if we just have a look at their latest one that they had just finished rebasing pro protocol again you might not see these on places like coin market cap they might not be the most known projects but I think, again, it's down to what you think they might be potentially able to do, starting off with these. They themselves are quite new and then moving on to bigger projects as well and adding more value. So this is really basic. I'm not going to go into the detail of it. It's quite basic. And one of the earlier ones that they did as well was Shrimp Swap Finance. They helped them IDO. And if you have a look at this, it looks very similar to what they did as well maybe with that knowledge and understanding they were able to help shrimp swap uh, launch with their ido so that that's what they're they're doing they're helping these idos and again if this can be a significant part of their project then it has a long way to go in terms of value from just a million dollars and they're audited by certic now this is great because it allows you to understand that what the, the the security and safety of the coin and the coding is it's been looked at by by certic and certic is quite a popular company for doing this they have a look at the different types of concerns they might have on different levels of risk they bring it to the attention of the project not only for them to plug those gaps and have a clean report but for obviously them to improve their their project too so that is something that has been verified by them so there you go that's salt swap uh, like i said it has the potential to grow they are doing the right things it was a much higher value beforehand came down now they're showing the type of things they're able to do, what they are doing. And I think even if this isn't something that you immediately want to get into, again, it's worth keeping an eye on what they're doing, what the price is doing, how much they're getting locked up into the pools and oceans and farms, because that's how much people are interested in it to, to gain value from this project. And also maybe keep an eye on IDOs and what their ideas that they're they're assisting with what they're doing are they going up are they going down um are they increasing in size as well and i think it's always good to keep updated with any project that you might think be a good opportunity even if you are invested into it you got to know what continues to happen with it so there you go that is salt swap finance Hopefully you found that useful, informative. If you have, please do give me a like. It does help the channel. Please do consider subscribing and bring out quite a wide range of videos. Normally small cap coins, sometimes IDOs, ICOs as well. Any coins that might even be larger that I think will grow in value. Bakery swap that I did recently is a good example of that. I thought it was going to go up in value. Gave the reasons as to why. And it has been doing considerably well. So I don't just focus on the very, very small coins. I think wherever... You can grow value in terms of what you buy. 
I do try to bring that information to you and any news and views as well for my cryptocurrency world experience. But there you go. That's Salt Swap. I've been Cal. This is Crypto Crazy. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.